Illegal drugs and violent behavior have plagued many of Hawaii's communities. Waianae is just one of them. Kukui and Gary Forth recognize that young people needed an alternative. That's where Ma'o Farm comes in. Uh, Ma'o stands for Malaai Opio, Malaai meaning garden and Opio meaning youth. And in that sense, as we tend to the earth, um, growing food, we also tend to our youth. My organic farm is about options. Uh, kids leaving high school these days, the problems, the societal problems in our community have just been compounded through crystal methamphetamine, through ice. You know, we, there really is no way to comprehend some of the problems that we have. But what we thought of is if we give kids another option where they are co-managers of a farm, where they have a lot of input and mana'o in, in the way the farm works and operates, then it'll give them some, some tools and some resources and some clues on running their own businesses, on being successful in college, on uh, being leaders in their community. Yeah. And leadership, I think, is the key, you know, is how do you get to that leadership? And a lot of it has for us in our experience been about restoring self-esteem, uh, restoring, you know, the aina, you know, because a lot of us hurt. And this is one way that we can help, you know, when we heal the aina, we're healing ourselves mm -hmm. as Hawaiians and as people of the land. Because I came from a football background, I get plenty of football friends. And they tend to look at this and say, why are you doing this? I look at them and say, you know, if you guys was working up at that farm just like how I am right now, you guys would feel exactly the same way. If you guys really love Waianae football, you guys gonna love my own. As I started to work on this farm, I started to get a sense of pride for living where I live. I live in Waianae, and a lot of people kind of give back to the community in a way where they really want to. And in this case, I give it back exactly the way I want to. Uh, by giving them food that would be, you know, edible, good, you know, and healthy. And keeping everybody in Waianae healthy is a pretty good thing to give back to your community. The key core component is, is a 10-month long leadership training program for youth. And it's for out-of-school youth in particular, 17 through 25-year-old youth who are from the Waianae region, Nanakuli, Luulule, Waianae, Makaha. The most important part of the farm, I think, is it gives youth um, an additional option in life. Um, we found that um, kids were leaving school and they had no options. The main option was to either leave or, you know, they were drawn to the beach parks where there's all kind of activity going on. Part of my hope and my vision for this program anyway, or this leadership development, is to restore the hope um, for for the future. Digging their hands in the rich soil of their community, young people are seeing that the future can provide a new beginning.